So as you can probably tell by the name of this video, it's going to be a monster inspired eye look. Um, what I came up with is this that I have on right now. I'm going to show you it. Just a really, really pretty and like vibrant green eye with black in the crease and then a nice bright white highlight. look based off of this Monster Energy can. You can see that the main colors are mainly that lime bright green, which I represented on the lid, and then the black of the whole can, which is what the crease and outer corner color are. And to get into the mood of the Monster look, I'm also wearing my Monster t-shirt, which I love. And I'm really excited to show you girls this look, so if you'd like to see this, keep on watching. Alright, so this is the look we're going for today. It's like a monster energy drink inspired look. So to start off this look, you're going to want to take anything to prime your eye. I'm just using Cover Stick, which is a concealer. You just want to prime your eye all the way up to the brow bone. This is going to give a really good base for the green colors to stick onto. Next, I'm going to go into this palette. It is by Wet n Wild and it's the I Dream of Greeny palette. I'm sure you girls have seen this before. It's a really, really pretty palette with a bunch of green shades. And I'm going to take the eyelid color, which is this really cool lime green color, onto this flat shader brush. Just pack that onto your brush and apply this to the lid. You can see how nice of a like bright green color it is, which is like exactly like the monster logo. I'll show you it really quick. You can see it's that bright green, and that's what we're doing on our eye. Bright green. Alright, so once you have this green base on, we're going to go in with the crease color from this palette. It's just a little darker of a green, and it has some shimmer in it. So we're going to take that onto a crease brush or something small like this and we're just going to swipe that into the crease and it is really pigmented so you only want to do like a little bit a little goes a long way and we're going to blend this out because it's really harsh right now as you can see so we're going to blend that out just want to make sure you're cutting the crease very neatly and if you mess up just wipe it away and you can drag this down a little bit in the corners. Next, taking any just plain, clean blending brush, you're just gonna blend that color out so it's not as harsh. That crease color is coming up a little bit bluish, but it isn't blue at all in real life coming off a little bit turquoise, I'm not sure why, but you're gonna take any black eyeshadow that you have that's really pigmented, you want a really nice black color. I'm just using this single eyeshadow from CoverGirl, I'm not sure what it's called, but any black eyeshadow will do. You wanna get this onto a pointed crease brush, like this, and we're just going to start off from your cr the end of your crease, and place your brush there and draw a line. You're gonna then connect that through into your crease.
try not to blend right here on this edge though because you want that pretty harsh to give it that straight and neat look. All right, so you can see. And now for our highlight color, I'm going into the palette Emerald Isle by Maybelline. This is the palette and I'm gonna use this brow bone color. It's just a little creamy white color. You could use white, you could use a light green. Like this palette has a little light green, but I wanted something a little bit brighter just to make the eye pop. So you're gonna apply that under your brow bone. Now to line the eyes, I'm just going to use my gel eyeliner. It's by Maybelline and it's in the color Very Black. Alright, so I just got a little better lighting because I saw that it was getting a little dark. But um, where I was at was I was lining my eye. So I'm just going to continue doing that. Just dipping that into my gel eyeliner. want to extend it a little bit you're not going to wing it you're just going to be extending the eyeliner a little bit more out so just straight out just like that next I'm going to take my pencil eyeliner this is my favorite eyeliner it's define a line by I think Maybelline yep and it's just in black and I'm going to take this and just apply that to my waterline. I don't like to line the bottom of my waterline because I feel like it closes my eye up too much. So I'm just going to line halfway on the outer edge. Connect that to the top part. So about that much is all you need and then you're going to take the smudger side of this and just smudge that outward so it's not as harsh. Next is just to apply lashes. They're just your basic eyelashes. I mean, they're a little bit thicker, you can see. And I just trim them in half. So this is one half of the eyelash. And I used the uh, one half on this edge. You want to make sure that you're putting the longest piece to the outer corner. So I'm just taking my duo lash adhesive and apply that to the eyelash. And you just want to wait for that to become tacky. So you can blow on it to speed up the process. So now that it's tacky, I'm just going to apply it to the outer corner of my eye. So the last thing you're going to want to do is to apply your mascara. I'm using the Falsies Flared Mascara by Maybelline. Just apply this to the top and bottom. Applying mascara to false lashes just allows them to last a lot longer on your eyes because you're actually blending your lashes with the fake lashes and it just makes them more secure and able to stay in place. One last step, this is optional if you just like to add a little bit more green to your eye. I'm taking this green eyeliner by Milani. It is called, let's 
the Infinite Eyeliner in the color Eternal. So I'm just going to take this, it's just, it's kind of difficult to apply, but if you work slow with it, then you should be able to do it. I'm just going to apply it from the inner corner to about where I ended with my black eyeliner. And that's it for the monster energy look that I've created. I think it's a really fun look and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Can I come in my video? So I was filming and look who decided to open the door and come see me. My kitty cat. Say hi, Tinksy. Say hi. Tinksy, look. Look up there. Oh, your eyes look so cool. Your eyes look so cool, isn't that cool, Jamie? Wow, your eyes go with my makeup look. I wish I had your eye color. All right, bye.